Hey what's going on everyone this is Ariviews back with another video and today I will show you guys how to create an amazing iOS 14 home screen setup. The tutorial will include all the steps that you need to follow in order to make this setup. Also you will find all the links that you need right down below in the description of the video. Now the first thing you want to do to create this setup is go ahead and set the black wallpaper that you will find on the settings app. So go to the settings, go to your wallpapers, go to stills and just set this as the home screen wallpaper for your device. And now this is step one. What you need to do is go ahead and add the widgets that of course will be linked right down below in the description of the video. So wherever you are on your home screen, just move to the last like page that are, there are like no icons, nothing at all and tap the plus button to add the first widget. Now the first widget will be from an app called Usage. Go ahead and add the first one which is the battery widget. Tap on add widget and you can see right there it shows you the percentage of battery and you can notice like the widget is blue but it will just the blue color will go down as the battery discharges so it will go all the way down of course if it hits 0% so that's really really cool. And now what we need to do is add another widget. The next widget is from an app called One Widget. So you go to the widgets panel and add the first one. It's called Single Show One Widget. So just tap right there. And now you go ahead and go right here, force touch on it, and go to Edit Widget. And what you need to do here is just go ahead and pick right here this one. You can see right here. Just like that and then go ahead and choose theme and from here what you need to do is choose yellow. Now of course you can configure these with, with different colors if you want to. I will just show you guys how I created mine so just like that now you will have that one right here. Go once again here and let's make the numbers there and the text of course let's make that black so go to edit widget choose on tint color and choose black right here and here we have now the two widgets added on the home screen i usually put the blue one right here on the left side the other one on the right side and now what we need to do is add the custom icons to create the custom icons that you saw on this setup i have chosen this app called app icon maker now this app allows you to create your own custom icons now i have created four with a yellow color and four with a blue color of course to match the widgets that I have on the home screen. So what I would do right here is go ahead and pick one of the icons. So you have icons here for apps, you have a few of the famous apps and then you have other symbols which you can also use to create icons. But I use just like eight of these to create like different icons for the apps that I use the most. So here for example Instagram and what I do is go ahead and use the slider to make the icon as big as I can. Now what you're going to do here is go to color and if you want to create the yellow icon you tap right there that color and if you want to create the blue one you tap this blue right here. So once you have done that you go to background and just choose the black background right there. Tap on the next button and of course choose the app here Instagram. Let's type here Instagram. And once you're done, click done, click confirm and now the app will redirect you to Safari. Now from here you will be able to add this as a home screen icon. Now when it goes to Safari it should show a page right here. If it just hangs like this, go back to the app and click just confirm once again and you would be good to go. So here we have the share button, add to home screen. You can change the name there if you want to, click add. And now there we have the icon. Now I can go ahead and move it right here. So you can see how cool that looks. Of course, it matches right there, the widget with the blue color. So what I do here, I would create four of these icons with the blue color, put them right there, and then four other ones with the yellow color and put them right here. So once you have created the icons, it should look something like this. So you will have four blue icons right there, Four yellow icons right here you can see how cool that looks now of course you might have different color apps right here on the dock so what i would do here is just go ahead and remove these apps from the dock here and place two icons with blue color and two icons with yellow color right here and of course just organize them to match the colors here now what i'm going to do for the last step for this page because i have other pages as well on this setup is just add like white text here from an app called One Widget. So just go ahead and go to the widgets panel. Now on the widgets panel, go to One Widget and go ahead and choose right here, this one, medium double, 
and once you have added to the home screen just go ahead scroll it down right here and now you have to edit this so what i do here is just go ahead and go to the edit mode choose first type now on the first type i have added the storage space on the second type i have added the calendar so here we have desktop calendar and then we have here theme so we go with black and then just like this you can see how cool that looks of course it will all merge with the black wallpapers and it looks really really nice on this setup i have another page right here on the right side so we have here shortcuts and also we have four different widgets which are all from the same app so what i've done here is i've added the two by four widget from the shortcuts app and what i did here is just go ahead tap on the edit widget and just choose the favorite folder of course you can pick any folder that you have on the shortcuts app and have it on the widget right here now here we have widget battery widget which is basically an app that allows us to add these widgets so what you have to do is just go to the widgets panel go to battery widget and go ahead and add the small one so you will have to add four of these small ones and then from here you will have to put them on the home screen on that page and then edit them from there once you have added four widgets from battery widgets they will be all the same but what you can do here is just go ahead and 3d touch on one of them tap on edit widget and choose here what info you want to see on that widget of course you can have four different ones so you will have the ram memory the brightness you have the battery and the storage of your iphone now this setup doesn't end here if you go ahead and swipe like this go to the widgets panel you can see that here i have four more widgets so basically at the top i have favorites this is a widget that allows to have your favorite contacts right there and quickly can call any one of them from here then i have another widget here from hello weather which basically shows you the hourly forecast for your location or any other locations that you choose and it will show you also the forecast for the next three days so that's really really cool and right here i have social stats so this is an app that allows us to have social stats on the home screen of your iphone using widgets so you basically go ahead and just enter the basically the accounts that you want to actually go ahead and follow on this app so you tap right there and you can go ahead and choose which account so for example if i go to twitter i can go ahead and enter a twitter name here and then i will be able to follow that account and once you have added the widget you go ahead and 3d touch on it tap on edit widget and just choose the account that you have already added and follow it on that widget and you can have them right here which of course looks really really cool so that is it for this video guys this is how you can create this amazing setup on the home screen of your ios 14 device this is a full tutorial step by step on how you can do it on your device as well now i've chosen here these two colors of course you can choose other colors if you want to just make sure that you edit the widgets that they look the same color as the icons that you put on the home screen so that's basically it for this video guys if you're interested on creating this setup or having like any widget or anything from this setup make sure you go ahead and check right down below on the description of the video you will find all the links that you need right there thank you guys for watching and i'll see you on the next one